he did something wrong. Now I know this is not much. He could not he could not be independent. Well that's his problem, not mine. You better stop playing game but you know me grow. Miss Eden, she's not on the screen no more. She's not on the screen no more. She's on the... I heard she's on the floor with her with her pen. Man. Yeah. She does. And now Miss Rose... Miss Rose... has her job back today. And I was like, I don't know what I'm picking this rose, but she is really nice. But, yeah, she's bad. And you can see, um, yeah, Ms. Rose is back to where she was. Yep. And Ms. Eden, uh, I heard she's in a pond though with her pen. And she can't come back here in New York because it's too much a lot of money to pay for like, you know, you're flying back and forth in different states. So she could not come back. She was supposed to come back before, but um the single parents don't like let her go back here in New York, I think. And that's the reason he is in this world sometimes. I don't know who was going to be in that future. I was in the first day. In the first, in the first, first day of school, in September, we were like, okay, I was thinking about it. Like, who is going to be my teacher? Besides, Miss Edie's not in, in school no more. And I'm glad Miss Rose um, came back. And, and, and she, she was like, she, um, you know what Miss Rose do? She don't, she don't, she don't sing the rap. She makes her sister. I know the girl must not talk. Yeah, I know. Victor, Victor couldn't, couldn't be do the right thing. What he just did is throwing me crap in the past. He just gave him a hard time with Miss Rose. You know Miss Rose, right? She don't, she don't fucking play. She just wanna be damn fucking serious. I was like, okay, what that's supposed to mean? I was like, God, oh, sure. Then I told, I told to Miss, to Miss Jennifer, Jonathan couldn't, couldn't have a either because even them did not do the right thing. And you know what, they, if they don't understand, they don't. That's why I want this crap in school. They're kind of whack. In the class, hell yeah, but... I can't tell you that I don't know what's going on in the fifth class. Me this year I'm trying to like focus on what I'm doing in this. And I'm happy that I pass my fellowship. I don't have to come to school with anyone. But you know I don't even put in, you know, so it's not good with it. Well, to me, uh, I don't get homework sometimes. I don't get homework. We work every day, every day. Sometimes we throw to the west a little bit homework. Yeah, and she, um, I couldn't. I think it would be like math homework, like it's math, because I need that. <clears throat> Sometimes, um, 
This guy, I don't know, he didn't say this until I told him to win. Because he couldn't not, you know, like, well, to me, I'm probably coming by myself, probably, and all the way to the end of the day. Yeah, I could, I could take the two, I could take two trains, going to Broadway, and then take the, um, the whatever bus in my area is. It's not that, it's, it's easy, but you have to know what to stop you off. So, you know what it is. I'm not gonna know. And I was like, my... And then Mr. J was like, Mr. J giving a lot of chance. He's trying to give a lot of chance to his victory. You know what Mr. J? He just didn't ruin it. He keeps ruining it. And you know what happened? Make the friends <coughs> came on screen today. I was like, what the hell? That's stupid. And Jonathan for did not work today because he did something wrong last week before. We don't earn the feel we need that much in my heart. And I told to Victor, you better stop that. Because, you know, I'm serious, you're not going to be in the family. I told him. And you're not, you're not going to be in the family at all. You're going to stay on the bus forever. I told him that. That's why I told that. Well, Nicholas okay, but Victor, then worse. Well, um, you know what Mr. Shirt do? You know what Mr. Shirt job is? Jonathan and Victor are taking the phone number because sometimes they play games or play music. Sometimes we girls let me go because I am independent because I travel all. I have to catch up the train and the buses to, to, like, um, to come home and back and forth. And me trying to change the me trying to change the rules every year. And that is I have nothing to say about it. Well this is not gonna change. He's not gonna change. He's still gonna be like that right here. Until this year, and then for that he talk. Watch. He's gonna be like that. Watch me. Watch me. No. You know what he do? He's playing around with Miss Rose. And Miss Rose don't like that. <coughs> These girls don't like to, um, play game in the past. Yeah, hell yeah. I told you, Lamar. These girls, I know these girls better about my She, um, she, um, don't play game. Don't play game. I told, I told her that, look, I'm trying to be good this year. Even if her, I have to keep, keep up trying doing it because I'm not in school with no more. Only in, in slaves and different buses. I'm not in school bus, I'm lucky because I, I could walk all the way to school. Um, Saida and Adana, those two, and Kinky, four of them are in different buses. Yeah, and you know what time I wake up in the morning? 7 o'clock. No, actually it's 45. I'm supposed to be getting ready. Uh, we're not doing gym no more. <coughs> nope. And the trying to change everything in the room. The trying to. They trying to change the rules in school. Everything. Mm. 
Mr. Keller, why he just keep it in? He just wanna, um, everybody to be, you know, safe or in school. That the rules and should be, if you like, like, you know, or she's, uh, certain things that have to, like, you know. I have nothing to say about it, but that's, I'm gonna do when you get there, but you know what Mr. should do? When they get here, like, in the morning in school, Mr. Shick does do a special phone. This is my with interview with Christine Bernard. And basically just be cleaning the phone every time. And we know last week and before the week that, um, Nick don't listen at all. He don't listen. And you know what, Nick? I told him before, I'm late. I'm running late. That, that, um, I was like, in the thing that I have to catch up the train and the buses. I come to myself, go. Yeah. Well, I have nothing to say about that, but with this, he couldn't not, he couldn't not, um, well, well, I have nothing to say no more, but, yeah, what? Well, I could travel from from the area. I could take the uh, um take different buses. Like two or four, I could take that and go in the area. I don't have to travel. I'm not good enough. I'm good. I learned this fast. Yeah, I'm good. 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 <clears throat> I could, I could, I could take train or buses at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I could travel by myself. And <clears throat> me, this year, um, I'm just like trying to be a little bit crappy in the work, you know. And then, um, we have some like little bit of UK I don't know how we got to do this. I don't know. Yeah, we have a UK, a little too. Alright, I will tell her tomorrow. I will tell her to say hi to you, okay? Now, Miss Rose, she just came back because she made her home room. Yeah, she just came back. She just, um, she just took Miss Egan's place because Miss Egan, she's not in the school anymore. And we had that movie like I said. Who is going to teach you how it's going crazy before the first ever of school? Yeah. And you know what Mr. Day do? He's not playing with us. Mr. Day is very, very serious now, this year. I told you, the well, I'm telling you. This is serious? No. Yeah. And now I don't want to make sure to... <coughs> to... Ashley? Ashley will change. She does change now. She, um... She's turning around, she don't act laughing, but she's kind of a little bit laughing. And there's no what. I told I I told you Ashley. Ashley trying to be like better trying to better help playing like you. Yeah. 